All right, well, what I have here, I have uh, a structure from my old map, and I want to bring it on to my new map. Uh, and the easiest way I found to do that is using the latest version of World Edit. I'm in um, Minecraft 1.2.4, I believe, and uh, which is, uh, as I'm recording this, the latest version. And so this is actually a really kind of great tool, because I have some things I want to bring into the new... Um, jungle world anyway so um, let's see here if you want to figure out where if you want to know where to go to get this uh, you can go to the bucket forums and go or just type in world edit in uh, in uh, Google and it'll come up and on there they'll have all the information for the server version but you can get the single player version here and um, uh, and then you can read about it and download it from here um, once you actually get it, it'll look like this, and you will want to navigate to your Minecraft folder, not the actual bin folder, but the full Minecraft folder, and it'll install all of the files that you need for World Edit, and then after that you can start Minecraft. Um, I'm on a Mac and it worked great for me, so I'm not sure how it'll work for anyone else. I'm not the most computer savvy person, um, but uh, it seemed to work out pretty well for me. So, uh, yeah, go there and get it. And the reason I use single player is because I have a little bit less likelihood of crashing out um, the server, even though sometimes the really big structures like the one I'm about to do, it may crash the game. Um, but that being said, if you're going to be doing this, make sure there's no one on your server because when you um, move your, f uh, your files over, so like I use FileZilla, um, from here uh, I took my new map and my where's my old map this one here and I copy them over into my saves folder where I have my minecraft so I went into my saves I just drag and drop the map files over and that way I could edit them on my computer and then after I'm done I then re-upload them again also always make backup copies um, anytime that I do this I always uh, back up my world but you know um, not everyone remembers to do that. So make sure you back everything up before you try this stuff out, kids. So um, I use uh, FileZilla, copy your stuff across to your computer, save it into your saves folder, and then you should be ready to go. Um, then install your single player uh, commands of World Edit through Bucket, and you're pretty much set. So um, I am here. I uh, started out, uh, let's see here, actually, you'll want to type in game mode one backslash game mode one and that will put you in the creative mode because you'll won't you'll probably start out in survivor sir uh, survival mode and I have this big tower here that I want to select and uh, it has a bridge going to a landmass and a bunch of good stuff that I put together so this may crash when I do this not the selection part but this is how you save a structure you might want to start small to test but I'm going to, using a, a world edit, I'm going to select this here. There we go. So I got my second position there. I'm going to come way down over here. I'll fall way down here. This may be a little bit choppy on the video. I apologize. But um, there we go. So I've got my big selection done, but I'm not going to copy it yet. I've got a whole bunch of land here selected. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the spot where I want to copy it from. So I've got it marked here with a piece of gold. There we go. Come on. There we go. <laughs> of course. Let's stand up here. All right. So now I'm facing relative to the structure because when I paste it on another map, it's going to paste relative to where I copied it from. So. Now I have it all selected. I type copy. It has now copied all that, and now I need to save it. Double backslash copy to copy. Double backslash save, and then I'm going to name it towers or tower one. All right, and there you go. Now I'm going to move to my other map. All right. And here we go. So this is where I wanted to paste what we just copied. 
now that I'm in a new map, I'm going to do, let's see here, I should be about the right distance here. Now, I did a really big structure, so it actually may crash on this, but uh, hopefully it won't. Um, smaller structures, you should have no problem. But the first thing we're going to do now is we're going to go double backslash load tower one, and then double backslash paste. Cross your fingers. And there it is. Just like that. And it looks like I, oh, yep, that's all there. So if uh, for some reason you load something like this, and of course it doesn't crash, and it's not where you want it, you can actually remove it. Here, my creative mode. Ah, that's not it. Game mode one. There we go. So let me take a look here. Looks pretty good. Yeah, I like it. So if for some reason you do not like where it is, you can actually go back and type undo. And that will actually undo the paste you just did. But I like what I got, so I'm going to leave it. And that is how you can move something from one map to another. So, of course, after you're done doing this and you've got it set up exactly how you want, you would want to save and quit. And then using your whatever you're using, um, move this file back to your server and then reload your server. And then there you go. Anyway, hope that helps.